If you're looking at an individual deal, that is something you sell between you and another person. That could be a consulting service, that could be a product, whatever financial transaction takes place between you and other people in your business, this is called a deal in Ninjoto. At the top left, you'll either see product images or contact images. Underneath, you'll see any person that's involved in this deal, including suppliers and people in your team. Along the top, we have the name of the deal. In this case, we've sold 50 widgets. You could have consulting service. You could have bookkeeping. The name of a deal is just whatever you've sold to that person. Moving down, we have the status of the deal. Is it one, is it still in the pipeline or has it been actually lost? And if you wanna change that, simply click and it will toggle automatically. Continuing on, we have the start date or the day the deal was won. We also have the option for an end date and that could be used in different ways in different businesses. Below that, we actually have any additional details that are required and that's a good place for you to put specific notes about this sale as opposed to another 50 widgets sold to somebody else. Moving up to the middle, we will have any company related information. That's contact details, addresses, and the link through to the company record if it's a B2B transaction. Over to the right, we have the workflow in relation to this deal. You have the option in Injoto of creating as many workflows and sales flows as you need for different scenarios so you can structure and automate the steps that you need to go through when you make sales. Down the bottom, we have tasks in relation again to this deal. And in the middle, we have our typical history. We have any money and transactions related to this, including not just revenue, but expenses, as well as any attachments. As with all records in Ninjoto, if you need to edit, look to the top right for the edit button. If you're looking to add a task or a note, look up the very top to the plus sign, click on that, and you have all of your available options for this page right there.